hello guys welcome to my youtube channel my name is kobe and this is sky tech digital in this video i'm going to show you how you can be able to use elementor off canvas widget so we're going to um you know use the new widget that elementor have introduced which is called the off canvas widget now i'm going to show you how it works so i have um you know i've done it with this particular um section that i'm working with right now so if i click the click here right now you see that there is going to be an off canvas um, widget that shows here is it okay so now you can use this widget as anything as you want to use so for instance if you want to um, use it as um, let's say a pop-up you can even use it as a pop-up if you want to use it as um, let's say you know a menu you can even use it as an off canvas menu and it, it will help you in all your designs that you're going to do okay so now let's let me show you how this thing works so basically you can add it to anything like a link or like anything okay so for instance i can like um link it to this button or i can link it to anything as what as a link okay so that is what i'm going to show you how you can be able to um use it so if i click over here right now the pop um the off canvas will definitely show okay and you can click outside to close it so i'm going to use this particular page over here this is the page that i'm going to use and i've already prepared the page already and as you can see it looks um, pretty nice with some gradient background if you don't know how i did this gradient background um please check the the video that i did about gradient background i'll leave a link in the description for you to also know it but if i click over here nothing happens okay so basically nothing really happens this is because i i haven't you know um link this one there is no off canvas that i'm going to use um that i've done with it so i'm going to show you how you can be able to use the off canvas um in any web design project that you are doing so let's go to elementor over here and then i'll show you how you can be able to um you know link it so this is elementor i've prepared the page already so if i come over here to my um button over here i can go over here and then um, you know link it if i want to link it but first of all let's look at the off canvas um, widget so if you go to your um, widget over here and then if you scroll down to the bay um, the pro widget okay you're gonna see the off canvas widget over there so you see this is the off canvas widget that we are talking about so i can drag it into the um, the container over here and then it will i'll be able to what, edit it the way i want it so let me just drag it into this container so i'm going to drag it underneath this button over here okay uh, i'm just going to drag it drag it over here and as you can see it shows as a normal widget and this is how um it is okay so this is the what the widget with its settings over here and this is the off canvas what widget and if you look at it there is nothing in it it's just a container really in it okay and that is what basically it so you can um you know position it anywhere you want to position it so i can position it on the um on the end or on the right hand side okay i can position it also on the left and then i can also position it in the center okay so it depends on how you want to what you want to position it so basically that is what that is the um you know how the settings really looks like and you can um style the the you know style it you can do it anyhow this is the also the the settings also over here you can um give it an entrance animation and all those kind of stuff but first of all let's let's work on this particular um you know um of canvas widget so i'm going to just give it a style okay so i'm going to go over here and give it a style so i'm going to just give it a background okay going to give it a background and let's let's just take some um background over here i'm going to give it this um color over here so it's going to be um, this color is going to be the blue color over here but i'm going to just reduce the um you know the color opacity over here so i'm going to just turn the opacity down okay and then um you know just take it like this so you see how it is it's it's becoming like a little bit of transparent kind of a thing okay blending with what with what we have over here but of course you can also um turn it up over here so if you don't want it to be um you know um the opacity to be let's say um kind of like a transparency you can turn it off okay so that is it and then i can just tweak the um the colors and other stuff to make it the way i want it so i'm going to just leave it as this um let me see yeah i'm going to leave it this way 
I'm going to leave it this way. And then um, it's going to be um, the way I want it. Okay, so this is how it's going to be like. And then um, after that, you can give it a shadow if you want to. You can, you know, give it an overlay if you want to. It depends on it. So let's say if you give an image over here, um, you can give it an overlay if you want to. If you want a border also, you can also give it. If you want a border radius, you can also do so with it. Okay, so now inside the off canvas, there is a container. Okay, so this is the container inside the off canvas. Now let's go over here. And then let's um the container is where we're gonna what we're gonna put things in okay oh, of course you can add different containers and other stuff also in it so inside the um of canvas there is what there is a container over here so with this container you can what you can style the container so i'm gonna go start the container you see i've clicked on the container to style it now i'm gonna go to it advance over here okay i'm gonna give it um let's say a pattern okay so i'm gonna give it a pattern of um top I'm going to unlink this pattern and give a pattern of top 50, bottom 50. And then I'm going to give a side and side 20. So I'm going to give 20 over here and then 20 over here. Okay, so um, let me give this one 50. All right, so this is how it's going to be like. So inside this container, I want to put something in it. So I'm going to just put some few things inside a container. So I can put a container inside it. I can put anything I want to put inside it. But um, I don't want to, you know, um, do a whole lot of things. I just, you can design it just like a normal page you are what you are designing it. Okay, depends on you, depends on how you want to what you want to go about it. But then I just want to put, um, let's say, an image, um, a heading, a text, and, you know, just a button. Okay, so I'm going to go over here and put um, an image inside this one. I'm going to put an image inside this one. And then I'll go ahead and then put a a heading also inside i'm gonna put a heading also inside it and then the last one i'm gonna drag a text also inside it i'm gonna drag a text you can put even um you know menus and other stuff you can put anything that you want to put inside over here you can make it like a you know a menu that people will be able to um use it to jump to different part of what of the website so it depends on you it depends on how you want to what you want to run the whole of canvas thing okay so um basically that is how it looks like and that is how it's gonna be like so um the last one i'm gonna put just um an icons or you know just some social icons also inside it so i'm gonna drag a social icon and put it beneath this particular one all right so now um i'm just going to you know style it okay so let me start from the icon um with a shape i'm going to just make it circle and then i'm going to leave it as it is and then with the text also i'm going to position it um just in the middle so i'm going to go to style over here just make it in the middle over here you know center over here and then um, the heading over here also um i'm just going to you know go ahead and go and then position it in the middle also so it's going to be something like this you can style it anywhere but that is not the important i just want you to know how you can be able to use this particular widget so i'm going to also go over here and then um choose an image that i want to use so i'm just going to use this image over here okay so this um, particular quality assurance image over here all right, so something like this, and then I can go ahead and then style the image, change the width to like let's say um, 35. All right, so it's gonna be something like this. Okay, so um, maybe I want to change this one to maybe welcome or something like that. Okay, so or uh, anything, anything that you want to write. So let's say um, social media okay so it's gonna be something like this okay and as you can see it looks pretty good it looks pretty fine okay of course we can also go ahead and then check our container and then if i want we want to you know just position the whole thing in the middle we can go ahead and then put the whole thing in the middle and then center everything over here okay we can go ahead and center everything over here so um it's it's going to be something that you really really will need um going for it you really really need it okay so um if you are using elementor pro this is the best thing that you, you can be able to use to navigate through your you know having an off canvas it's it's really one of those things that add more interactions to your 
website so if everything is okay you can go ahead and then you know just um, publish it okay let's say we want to publish it over here okay so we publish it but then what happens nothing really happens okay so nothing really happens because we have not set the off canvas now let's go over here to off canvas okay let's go to the off canvas settings over here and then let's go to it um layout over and you see this one it says editing mode meaning that we are editing it okay so if you want to turn it off we can decide to go ahead and turn it off okay and as you can see it goes but if you click it to turn it on it will definitely show for us okay so we can go ahead and then you know just um do some few settings if you want to position the vertical thing um, in center we can do so also over here if you want to position um you know um the horizontal um position also we can also do so over here okay so this thing works only vertically if you have um you know something that you are dealing with okay and then it is also mobile response and of course you can also change the width of the of uh, the off canvas okay you can change um the width to match any kind of width that you want to um you know to use okay so it depends on how you want to what you want to use it you can change the weight and other stuff and then also you can um you know it is mobile responsive you can check out in um, other uh, mobile sites so with this one i can reduce the weight a little bit okay so that um, i'm gonna have something um, you know some i want people to see um, something over here okay now basically that is what that is it so let's um just you know off um, go off through the editing mode okay so i'm going to go to the desktop and then go off um, the editing mode and then now it is time for us to link our off canvas to anything that we want to link it now we want to link it to a button over here okay so what we're going to do is um, we're going to click on this click here button and then um you see there is a link over here but we can't link it just like that we will use the dynamic link over here or the dynamic tags over here so we're going to click on the dynamic tags this particular um, icon over here and then scroll down and then where you have um, actions and the actions we have off canvas over here just click on it and then you can click on this ranch icon or the settings icon to check out the settings of it and then as you can see this is what an action which is off canvas and then you can select um you know any off canvas widgets that you are using so we're going to select this particular one over here and that is what what it will, what it will show so now we have um selected it and then um, we can just go ahead and publish it so we're going to publish it okay let's publish it and after we publish it we can go ahead and view it on the front end and see how it looks like so we're gonna go ahead and refresh the website so let's just refresh the website all right guys so let's click on the click here button and let's see how it looks like okay guys so this is how it looks like it looks pretty well and that is how we want it to be so this is how you can be able to create um, you know an off canvas um, thing using Elementor Pro so if you don't have Elementor Pro I'll leave the link in the description for you you go ahead and get yourself elementor pro and use this off canvas widget to be able to design your website the way you want it thank you for watching see you in the next video my name is kobe please don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel bye bye